Over the last uh, 25 years, we've set our strategies, we've reviewed our strategies, we've set objectives, we've set our goals. We've obviously, I've had our uh, achievements, we've had our failures. I think what's important is that wherever we've failed, we've learned our lessons overall uh, for businesses like ours, and indeed at individual level. What we tend to celebrate is obviously our successes. I think we found a lot of successes uh, along the way. And I think when I talk about these successes, uh, this is something that every employee of CEC needs to be proud, uh, proud about. I mean, one of the key assets that every company is proud of is its, its, its employees. And over the uh, 25 years that I've worked in CEC, I've seen a lot of changes uh, from an employee perspective, from a sort of culture uh, perspective. And I think we've created something that is a force for good, both in terms of creating wealthy uh, for our investors, our local communities, and indeed uh, for, for, for Zambia. And I'm quite happy to also see uh, the contributions that we've been able to make to the local communities because you can only make those contributions if you find success and therefore you share some of that success. The, the CEC journey is not ending today. Um, we are obviously becoming uh, bold as we look at the future. We, turned on, we, 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 we plan on taking on uh, very, very bold uh, goals uh, as, uh, as, as a business. Today, we are a company that uh, makes a net profit of between 50 to 60 million uh, dollars. Over the next five years, our target is to try and grow that uh, to 100 million dollars, uh, for example. That will not be an easy feat uh, to achieve. And I invite all the employees in CEC uh, to join me on that journey to grow CEC's uh, profitability from where we are today, around $50 million, to almost double it uh, to $100 million over the next, over the next five years. For, 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 for me, as, uh, as Owen Silavo, it's been such a privilege to have been in this role as uh, uh, CEO of CEC over, over, the last, over the last nine years. Um, I should say I've really enjoyed uh, working with the various stakeholders uh, in, this, in this company. Uh, on top of that list is obviously the employees themselves that I've worked so closely with the various teams. And in CEC, we believe in creating the, these strong professional, professional teams. And I think through that, uh, we've been able to create uh, something that I think uh, continues to work uh, for for uh, for this company. I believe the company is uh, on the on the on the right path. When I look at uh, the levels of motivation, uh, the belief uh, in what uh, the company can uh, can achieve, uh, the focus uh, on uh, on performance, uh, the view that we need to scale up all aspects of, uh, of the business. I think it's just been great, uh, to say the least, uh, for me uh, to, to work and collaborate uh, with, uh, particularly, as I said, the employees, uh, the, 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 the board, uh, the customers uh, of, uh, of CEC. I therefore believe that this company has a bright future, uh, the achieving uh, the future that we want uh, for our business, so obviously, won't be easy. This requires hard work. It will require us uh, to mobilize resources and throw 
uh, those uh, important resources at everything that we want to achieve. But I certainly believe that uh, we have what it takes uh, to move and advance uh, this uh, company uh, to where we want, it, uh, uh, we want it to be and be in a position uh, to contribute to economic development in all the markets that we operate, whether you're looking at Zambia, you're looking at DRC, you're looking at SADC in general. I think the company is uh, uh, geared uh, to make significant contributions uh, in its uh, in its markets.